And check this out. Rocket scientists are close to a breakthrough, and it could be a game changer for space travel. Fox 35's Amy Caulfield has the details this morning. This idea started just as a simple sketch in a in napkin. Ad Astra CEO Franklin Chang Diaz talks about his Vasimir rocket that could revolutionize space travel. The concept, heat argon gas to such a high temperature that it becomes plasma, then use the plasma to power a rocket. Plasma is what the, the, the sun is made out of, then the stars are made out of plasma. These are gases are millions of degrees. The company is in the testing phase. This weekend, they'll see if it can run nonstop for 100 hours. Not an easy task when you consider the temperatures inside could reach 5 million degrees. There is no material you can put in anywhere near 5 million degrees. It won't melt. So they're using a, a high density uh, magnet, uh, magnetic field to hold the energy and the fire in a certain place and direct it out the back of the rocket. It's, it's very sophisticated. Space Florida CEO Dale Ketchum says the technology being used for the rocket is very impressive. With this type of technology, if you're heading to Mars and something goes wrong and you need to go home, you just turn it around because you got the engine to come back. So being able to turn around in space is something we've never had before. The rocket wouldn't just be able to turn around. It also promises to get to Mars much faster. Right now, it takes nearly eight months to get to the red planet. This rocket promises to do it in less than eight weeks. 39 days uh, is a reasonable thing to do if you have the right reactor. Making the idea of sending humans to the red planet much more realistic. It's an exciting time to be alive. Amy Caulfield, Fox 35 News.